Welcome back. Founded in 2002, Fresh Direct creates fruit experiences and drives simple, healthy solutions to make every day better for its customers. Now, with the Super Bowl and Valentine's Day just a couple of days away, my Philadelphia Eagles, go Eagles, two days away, yes. Uh, guess what? Fresh Direct is helping to spread the love this February. And we've got joining us right now a very special guest, the Vice President of Mar Merchandising at Fresh Direct. And we've got Charlotte Meyer. And uh, Charlotte, thank you for joining us. And uh, a very busy February for you, huh? Absolutely, yeah. Thanks for having me. We're, we're gearing up for a fun month. Yeah, so uh, talk to me about this month, because obviously uh, a lot goes into this month, as we said, the Super Bowl, you got Valentine's Day, uh, African American History Month, all kinds of different things happening throughout the course of February. Yeah, so we thought this year with the Super Bowl and Valentine's Day falling just a couple of days apart, you know, what are some kind of fun, creative ways that we could combine those two really cool uh, food occasions? So we came up with a bunch of ideas to to help customers sort of celebrate the Super Bowl and Valentine's Day all all at once. So um, you know, whether it's kind of party snacks that feature heart shaped items or um, using some leftover, well, leftover maybe doesn't sound so great, but using some um, products that they bought for their Super Bowl spread to make breakfast in bed on Valentine's Day morning, just kind of coming up with some fun, creative ideas for customers to be able to, yeah, kind of celebrate both holidays at once. And so for yourself, uh, talk to us about the holidays. You've got Super Bowl. Uh, anything particular you tell us about what, can, what what people can look out for during Super Bowl time? For us, one of the kind of most fun things to do for the Super Bowl is pizza, right? We're, you know, a big New York, New York crowd over here. So we always love our pizza. And something fun you can do with pizza this year to sort of recognize Valentine's Day and the Super Bowl at the same time is to make a heart-shaped pizza. So we have, you know, for sure an instant pizza dough that we we sell on the site. And um, so that way you can just make your own pizza at home. And if you shape it into a heart, you can do a little bit of, of celebrating for both holidays. Um, another kind of fun thing to do with pizza is to take pepperoni and cut those into the shape the shapes of hearts so that you can kind of adorn your pizza with a nice heart-shaped topping. Uh. I know also drinks are of the high uh, of the high quality during this time of year. Everybody's trying to be into drinks, uh, whether it's, uh, you know, that frozen beverage or something else. Yeah, absolutely. So we've um, got all kinds of fun drinks for, for your game day, your Super Bowl watching party. One of my personal favorites is the High Noon Spiked Seltzer. It's actually a vodka-based canned cocktail. So um, it's it's really, you know, Really nice tasting, really fresh, uses real fruit. So definitely recommend getting a variety pack of high noons on hand for, for any of your kind of canned cocktail drinking friends. Yeah. So for yourself, talk about the planning process. How long is the planning process for you to really get ready for February? I mean, it's rolled out right now, but I know you guys have been in the trenches thinking about this for a minute. We have. I mean, for us, it, it kind of goes all the way back to, you know, six months ahead of time when we're starting to think about what does the Valentine's Day candy selection look like. But really, when we kind of begin the year, we're, we're really thinking about this big holiday, this big food holiday being the Super Bowl. So starting to come up with some creative ideas around different Super Bowl recipes, different um, ways to kind of bring new and fun solutions to our customers for, yeah, for the Super Bowl. And, and also for Valentine's Day, you know, whether it's breakfast in bed recipes or um, you know, Valentine's Day dinner at home, just coming up with a lot of a lot of fun, a lot of fun content and, and inspiration for our customers. Yeah. Uh, talk to me about your customers. What do they say during this time of year? Are you hearing uh, any particular requests or anything they're asking of? Well, I think, you know, people are people are looking for, like I said, kind of fun ways to do Valentine's Day dinner at home. So we always do a, a really a really cool program with our meat and seafood departments. We're bringing in kind of the best quality uh, locally raised kind of grass-fed beef and some really incredible locally raised seafood as well, locally um, sourced seafood. So we'll do kind of surf and turf, which is always really popular and a big hit for Valentine's Day. Um, we also, you know, we do it. We do a really nice selection of Italian products. So we know customers love to do a big pasta dinner for Valentine's Day. So we've got some great 
um, you know, truffles from Italy and, and pastas imported from Italy and lots of wonderful wines to go with them. So yeah, those are usually the, the big hits around this time of year. Yeah. Do you find it that uh, that Super Bowl Sunday, there's that mad rush? Yeah, absolutely. There's always, you know, as much as we kind of all prepare for our Super Bowl parties, there's always that one thing you forgot. So um, we do we do get quite a rush on Super Bowl Sunday, especially within our express business for people who need to stock up on some additional beer or additional snacks for their friends. Maybe they've got a few extra folks coming over. So um, yeah, it's 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 definitely a busy weekend for us. You know, generally, when we talk about Valentine's Day, uh, most of the emphasis that people place is on going out, getting that restaurant, making that reservation, doing that. But uh, tell me, are you finding more and more people are actually staying at home to celebrate Valentine's Day now? We are. We are. I think especially, you know, this year with Valentine's Day being on a, on a Tuesday, it's kind of a, a midweek um, a midweek holiday. So I, I think people are really enjoying using the holiday to, to cook something at home and maybe to learn a new recipe or, or to cook together. Um, yeah, to, to use that as kind of a fun experience rather than going out. Well, I want to tell you this, uh, hopefully for both the Super Bowl and Valentine's Day that you are, are able to handle the rush. And I know it's going to be an exciting time uh, for Fresh Direct because when the holidays come, uh, certainly that's when we see the people come out. And uh, as you said, months and months of planning. I hope that it all goes well. And uh, thank you so much for joining us. Thanks so much for having me, Darren. It's fun. And Charlotte Meyer, thank you. Vice President of Merchandising at Fresh Direct. Now, if you want to reach them, don't hesitate to find out more information on the website, freshdirect.com, then also on their social media platforms at Fresh Direct.